Hello Hooktubers, today we are making USB LED fan. First, we gonna make the fan blades out of this plastic jar lid. Next, we gonna drill two holes, one for wire that will make contact with metal washer and other for plastic gear from DC motor. With hot glue gun, I'm gluing the metal washer, the plastic gear and wires. From this ordinary pen, we gonna need the spring and this small plastic piece. On top of fan blade, we are gonna place it the LEDs in different colors. Soldering the USB cable to the DC motor connector. And because I want adjustable fan, I will place it on mini tripod. It turned out pretty cool guys, USB fan with LED effect.
for this project you will need of course bigger screwdriver, 300 inches copper wire, battery and battery holder, switches and some LEDs and resistors. Now wind the copper wire on screwdriver like I show you now. And you gonna isolate with electrical tape. We gonna need to drill 3 holes for switches and LEDs. On switches and LEDs we gonna solder some short wires. Placing the switches into the holes and lock them with hot glue. On top of screwdriver we gonna glue battery holder. The power on LED we gonna place it in this hole and fill it with hot glue again. This white LED will be placed in front of screwdriver and with heat shrink tubes we isolate the wires. In description below you can find a schematic how to wire up the whole screwdriver. I was inspired by sonic screwdriver from Mr. Who and honestly this electromagnetic screwdriver turned out pretty awesome and deserve a like from each of you Hacktubers. Thumb up! When you push the switch electromagnetic field is generated and you can lift some metal objects and play. Not to forget you can still use like a screwdriver. Now to explain, from battery voltage goes to main key switch that turn on the blue LED. From here goes to the push switch that power up the front white LED and copper coil which generate magnetic field. In comments below tell me what you think about this sonic screwdriver. This is 18650 battery holder and on back of case we are gonna glue wooden piece. Also attaching a mini switch on top of battery holder. You will need to put two screws on both ends of wooden piece. Positive wire from battery goes to switch and from here goes to metal screw. Negative wire is directly connected to other metal screw. Tight and secure it with hot glue. Heating wire or cantle wire I pull out from broken aquarium heater or you can pull out from dead soldering iron. Now wind couple of turns on first metal screw and proceed to second one. Insert freshly charged battery and start cutting some foam. Don't forget to hit that like button below and if you like these daily projects comment below what should I make in next video.